Uh, there are very few things. I've been at this. This is my 27th year at Fox 10, which is crazy. And there are very few things here that are as popular as our song Christmas Magic in the Valley that comes up every single Christmas. It was written by a man named Jolly Damas. The song discovered by former Fox 10 marketing director Jim Giroto. Oh, let, it, let, let me remind you if you haven't heard it 10,000 times. Hit it. There's Christmas magic in the valley. Anticipation, celebration, I hear sleigh bells ring, sleigh bells ring, I see evergreens, and I hear carolers sing, carolers sing, happy holidays from Fox 10. There you go. And you, that's our new promo this year. And we all, we all kind of shot it ourselves on our uh, iPhones and things because, you know, COVID. So here he is, Jolly, joining us with the story behind this song. Jolly, I got to tell you, our viewers go crazy for your song. Give me the genesis here. How, how did it all start? Well, it started um, on a cold uh, November day. I sat down. I was getting ready to take a flight to um, out to do a show in California. Snow started falling a little early in uh, November in Denver and sat at the piano, wrote the song, a four minute song. And um, that was the origin of the song. And then um, a year later, Jim Giroto at uh, Channel 9 here in Denver looked me up and uh, had heard the song that was originally going to be on a um, holiday on ice theme. And uh, that got canceled. And so he had the idea of making a uh, commercial out of the song for Channel 9, and that was 1988, and since then it's been in, I don't know how many markets around the country, but none as loyal as Phoenix, you and Buffalo are the top uh, top dogs. Yeah. Once 27 years, so. So we did a, so what you did was, you wrote a song, now the original song you wrote, was it based on being there in Denver, or was it just a general song, because then you kind of tweaked it and made it more of an Arizona theme for us. Yeah, it was just a, it was a Christmas song. I, I've always loved Christmas. And so I sat down and the song came out in like five minutes. It was, uh, which the best songs do like that. And um, it, it came out and then Jim had the idea of cutting the song to make it a commercial. I remember the first time we met um, in his office in Denver, he said, I envision this song being a Christmas card to our viewers like mm -hmm. White Christmas. And I gotta give Jim Giroto all the credit in the world. It was his vision um, to make it what it's become today. And I just supplied, I sing it and uh, wrote it. And, I, and, and I've customized it for each market. Like I've customized it for Phoenix and um, Buffalo and whatever market around the country. And Phoenix has been wonderful. I'll tell you, the people in the Valley have, it's, we've, we've had two CDs out with it. We've raised a lot of money. We've done a lot of good with the song. The viewers have written wonderful comments um, to me, so um, I can't thank you all enough. Well, no, we have to thank you. I mean, one time, and, and Jim Giroto, we're, we keep talking about him. He has since moved on. He's retired, and he's living a great life, from what I heard. Our producer, Jen, just talked to him the other day. One, I, I want to say it was about a decade ago, maybe longer. We thought, okay, uh, Christmas Magic in the Valley's had a great run. Now we're going to bring out this new Christmas song. I thought we were, people were going to storm the gates. I didn't know if this building was going to stand. People were so upset, and of course, by popular demand, we brought that song back, and you've had another 10-year run. It's, it's unreal, and I, well, it's, it's back to Jim's original vision about making, he said, I remember him telling me, you don't change White Christmas, do you? He goes, you want to hear it every year when the holidays come, and, and that's what we've accomplished, and, and like I said, it's, it's, I've been really blessed. It's, it's been so well received down there, and I can't thank the viewers enough and the station for, you know, being so supportive. Jolly, could you uh, do a, a number for us? Will you, would you mind singing the song for us? Sure, I can do a little bit of that. And as you get ready, tell, tell people, where can they find this? Can they download this song somewhere? Yeah, a lot of people have asked, and you can get the whole actual, the download is, is working because we're doing a Christmas version, but the whole four-minute song is available on my website at jollydemus.com. You can go and get the whole CD. It's on the CD called Evolution. Just go to Jolly Demas, J O L L Y D E M I S dot com. And um, that's one way to get it with 19 other songs uh, of mine. And um, 
that's probably the easiest way and, and look for it, you know, on iTunes coming up for the, the Christmas version because each, each market's a little different. So I want a lot of people want the whole four minute song. So Charlie, thank you, you so much. Okay, good. Great, great talk. I'm going to let you play us out. How's that? It was great talking with that? you. JollyDemas.com. Check it out. Take it away, Jolly. Thank you again. You got it. Old man winners back around. They lit up the Christmas tree downtown. There's Christmas magic in the valley. Anticipation, celebration. I hear sleigh bells ring. I see evergreen. I hear children sing. Christmas song.